Stop the damn car! Um, okay. Break, I said. Break. This is it. Let's go. Cut. Stay close. I'm gonna blow the motherfucker to bits myself. Okay. Have fun, bro. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna fucking kill him. <laughs> Look at this little guy. Oh, he's so excited. NCPD, stop right there. Oh. Lieutenant Vasquez, NCPD, stop right there. My friend would like to You're kill your passenger. You're protecting a murderer. Drop it or I shoot. Wait. No, stop. Stop the killing. <laughs> They're here to kill you. Oh, shit. That it's was not fucking their hilarious. Fault. The way this is the same underground squad raps now I'm really here spraying some rounds of y'all next And I don't wanna entertain nobody but I'm more These motherfuckers wanna change and I started to morph And now I'm revving up the engine at the beginning of the war I'm decided to put my mind, put the pedal to the floor Think I don't lost my mind I can't explain it, try to make it seem like I'm fine That lie is dangerous, sometimes bad things cross my mind I need some safety, can you take my hand and show me the light Baby, I can't take this, no I don't really give a damn about anything So in for this. I want to see I how this pans you. out. You're out of your fucking mind. Hey, another word from you, and I am calling the studio. Greg, you make me ruin your career. Busted an attempted hit on my nobody, guy. and I mean yeah, nobody. One cash will harm a hair. Build your blog's head. No priors. I'm just. We'll uh, run a deep sweep just to be sure. Borrowing you. Thank you. I guess. Thanks. Cool. I owe you. No patrol car, and stay what off the of frequencies this? too. Can't have this coming back. What's your name? This. Ch <laughs> we a fucking mess. Josh Stevenson. Told you to drop you it, dickhead. Already. Like, listen, nice headshot, though, bro. Listen. What was his We're name? We're clear to go. Boys from the precinct will mop Bill up Bill Jablonski. Here. Ring a bell. Sadly, yes. <laughs> Teach us to number our days that we may gain a heart of wisdom. Oh, you're insane. Wait a sec. You're V. I heard of you. Have you? Can't say the same about you. We can't take her. Out of the question. She's way too big a threat. Well, I want to give her a job. <sighs> Christ on a stick. Finally, something oh, that isn't a complete snore fest. Yeah, this shit's insane. I, I love this. Watch this all day if I had some popcorn. Yeah, you and me both, dude. Uh, all right. Gonna what do you tell want, me what dude? it is you I'm... want from me? Well, this one time, Rachel is right. <laughs> we can't stay here. Come with us. You'll find out all you need to know. Okay. Strongly. Totally in for this. Noted. This is hilarious. 
Ha! <laughs> That's it. Got no fucking idea what this is about. Yeah. But if you don't go with them, I'm never talking to you again. Yeah! That's what I'm talking about. Fuck yeah, Johnny. We're on the same page. All right. <laughs> Hello. Move it. We're running late. Oh, fuck, dude. Have you right in this fucking face. Anything that changed the meaning of existence. Changed your life. Yeah, sure. Could say that. Sure. Then you will understand exactly what I'm trying to do. Twelve years ago, I was sentenced to prison for armed robbery. And other sins. I shot and killed several people in cold blood, oh. and it didn't mean anything to me at the time. Several but people? behind bars, oh, you man. get all the time in the world to think. And I thought to correct the errors of my ways. Um... Okay. I still don't get why you're telling me this. I want you to understand what I am about to do. Spill already. What do you want from me? Stay with me for the day, and I'll pay you what you were promised to kill me. Okay. Uh, excuse me? With what money? Not mine. The studio's. And the studio will pay. Just Hell till yeah. the end of the day? Till the end of the day. I sense anything going wrong. I'm out. No one will force you this to This is stay. awesome. This is so awesome. Wakako. We're almost at Gloria LMR's. Looking us up again. Give me a moment. I need to prepare. <laughs> this is amazing. Vasquez, keep an eye on them. I'm gonna stay in the car. Keep it short. We're on a tight schedule. Okay. Oh man. Alright. What is happening here? We're we filming like some kind of fucking crazy BD or something? It's like a snuff film? Gotta be some snuff film shit, right? Zuleika? You're late. I found a companion along the way. Oh Someone God. from the studio? Do you remember what you wrote me in your last letter? She is everything you spoke of. V, meet Zuleka. Oh. Hello. V, pleasure. Mm. You are a friend of Joshua's? Recent uh, acquaintance, more like. <sighs> Mama isn't back yet. We can talk inside until she returns. Uh, come in. Hurry up. I'll be waiting outside. What are you thinking? Please, sit down. Um, okay. Can I offer you anything? A drink? Uh, I'm I'm good, thanks. I'm good, thanks. In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit, one God, Amen. Oh my God. Zuleika is the sister of the man I killed. She wrote me letters while I was doing time. That is how we two were united. Through forgiveness. Why are we here? And who are we waiting for? Tell me, V. Do you believe in God? <laughs> no. Can't say I do. Zuleika and I have a, a running dispute. I was thinking you could help us resolve it. No, no. I never agreed to anything like this. I'm all ears. Joshua, he... 
He thinks he's the Messiah and wants to end his own life. Yes. That yes. is not true. I never said I was any sort of Messiah. Suicide? Do you really think that's what the Lord could ever want from you? It won't be suicide. What exactly is going on here, Joshua? When the media learned I'd found God in prison, the next day my face was on the cover of every screen sheet. A brain dance studio took notice. They sent representatives to make me an offer. <laughs> Go on. Bloodsuckers. I was facing the electric chair. Now, with the studio's help, my death will be more than a state-sanctioned murder. They want to scroll a brain dance of Joshua being crucified. I An knew execution it. like any other. Knew just it. garbed in holy robes. Um. Why the brain dance? What's in it for you? Zuleika transformed me into a child of God. It's time I repaid that debt. I want to bear witness to love's existence in a manner that all the lost souls on this wretched earth can understand. Why love? If unconditional love exists, then so must God. It's time the world was reminded of His divine presence. Think of the millions jacked into their feeds like livestock. The children growing up in gang-infested streets. Do they know love? Think of the joy toys on Jig Jig Street. Coked out corpos in their offices, murderers who stalk the streets. I want to reach them. I will reach them. Jesus Christ. And think of paid killers like you. Yeah. Me. Have you known love? Do you know what it is? Uh, mother's home. Joshua Stevenson. We meet again. And who are you? My name is V. Hello. Go. You are not welcome here. Mrs. El Amar. I have come to beg you for forgiveness. You... You murdered my son. That is something I can never forgive. I truly do regret the pain I have caused you. Out of my house, now! Just go, please. Out, all of you. <laughs> all right. We should leave, really. Please, Mrs. Elamar. Murderer. It's okay. Just go. You took my Reuben from me, my child, my son. <laughs> Let's go back to the car. Why did we come here? Can I get paid now? Hello, Rando. Don't watch out for this guy, he's a good shot. Pan out the way you thought it would. Just wish I could have talked to Gloria and I explained everything. And somehow I thought I, I thought she'd find it in her heart to forgive me. Time to grab a bite to eat. Uh. Who could blame her? It's not easy to forgive your son's murderer. Stevenson, we all knew how that would end. If you yeah. forgive anyone their sins, they are forgiven. If you do not forgive them, they are not forgiven. <sighs> really aim to spin a virtue of your crucifixion? Ugh, yes, really. You'll be kicking up a shitstorm. Hater's gonna hate. Uh, what? It is You're on board? I must do. For if this won't shake the world to its core and wake us from our collective nightmare, then nothing will. Nobody cares, a dude. Nobody gives a shit. Wow. This guy is... 
Take Stevenson Holy inside. Shit. Grab us all a table. Need a word with our stowaway here. Uh oh. We're gonna have a little private chat, are we? Wait up a sec. I want to talk. Okay. Nice glasses. So, what do you think about our next big BD star? Um. I think he needs psychiatric care. Got some organic chips loose. Needs psychiatric help. Hmm. My thoughts exactly. But it's too late for that. Okay. He's as crazy as you say. Why is he so important to you? Because Stevenson's got a little something that's in short supply, but in very high demand. That little something's called authenticity. And that brain composed entirely of cat shit at this point. He truly believes what he says. The perfect actor. Ah, sounds like the perfect <laughs> BD actor. Mm-hmm, and one incapable of fucking up in any way. Stevenson could be a fat old fucking gold vein for our studio. And okay. that's my concern because... You're fucking with his mind, asking probing questions. You're making him doubt, and most importantly, jeopardizing my investment. So I'm prepared to pay you double what he's promised you to quietly walk away. Don't do it, V. Why not? Why Why not? Pay me more and I will. I know the kinds of budgets BDs get. You can do better than that. Lots better. Fine. Triple. And you disappear like the morning dew off North Oak front yards. Deal. Fucking pathetic. Very wise choice. Don't follow me in. I'll what, tell Stevenson What the fuck do you, you think goodbye. we're going to do here, Johnny? We have, like, no cash, Johnny. No cash. All right, let's see how much triple is. If it's 15K, I'm going to be pissed. All right, let's go. Uh, I, that guy was a fucking psychopath. That was great. Love that shit. Oh, wait, Pan Am. We're going to be Pan Am. Hold on. Uh, Pan Am. Yeah, you need some help with something. Let's go check it on what's going on with you. Hello. Whoop. No, the rest will stay here in camp. I want patrols every half hour. Reporting directly to me. V, we... you're here. What What's up, guys? What is she doing here? I forbade you from even breathing on that Militech convoy, so you call in your friend? To do it all behind my back? Is that it? Uh-huh. That's exactly why I had V come and stand right in front Got of me. Got no fucking clue what's going on here. Yeah. The fuck? Damn it to hell, Saul. Are you seriously considering letting that basilisk slip through our fingers? I am. Basilisk. But a chance like this. A chance at what? Rotting up the job we came here to do? Ah, oh, it seems a lot changed while I was away. No, nothing has changed at all. The Biotechnica people will be here in an hour. Try not to cock anything else up before then. I can't believe it. Look, there he goes, off to paint the grass green. Um. What's this basilisk nonsense? It's an armored Militech cargo panzer. Junk from back in 2060 or so. I know what one they is. I want to pedal it off to a backwards country, somewhere it can still pass as a technological wonder. The Militech convoy will take the 101 right past us. Shame not to say hello. This basilisk worth another fight with Saul. Yes, a craft like that would finally put us back on the right path. The family is falling apart. If we fall into this biotechnica rut, no one will ever take us seriously again. Okay, so you do want to go behind Saul's back. Drag me here specifically for that. Cassidy, Ted, Carol, and Bob also on board. 93. 93 is what we got from that job. Fuck, dude. V? Hold on. 93k. And you plan to grab the Basilisk, how? Thanks, V. Haven't said I'd help just yet. Okay, let's go talk to the rest. I know what I am to you, Pan Am. I'm just your problem solver, your fucking murderer. 
So, just the four vets on board with the plan. Nobody else. We didn't bother asking the others. There was too great a risk someone would take it to solve. I mean, Besides, if Mitch is involved, the then I'm down, understand but... what we have to gain by having a basilisk. Sounds pretty risky to me. On the contrary, easy as pie. There won't even be much security on the convoy. Plus, we'll be doing our part towards furthering the cause of world peace. Why should this beast wind up being used in some little third world skirmish? World peace, huh? We'll make better use of it right here in America. Okay. Did you try to get Saul on board again? Unhinged, man. No Unhinged. No. no. Okay, everyone listen. All right, Militech team. Will transport the basilisk and parts distributed across two trucks. Wait, do I sense a quiver in your voice? Fuck you. The convoy will halt at the railroad crossing on the 101. We'll attack from behind, then get the hell out and away. Questions? Comments? Motions? Nice job, sunshine. Mm-hmm. Well, I'm in. Short, sweet. Okay. I'm in. Hmm. Okay. Thanks. Nice. First, we'll Surprise. ride to the station. The train engine we need to block the convoy's way is there. Are you riding with us, or will we meet you there? Uh, I'll ride with. Riding with you. Excellent. Let's get going. I find that saying yes leads to a much more interesting life. I think I heard a little shake in that voice. You did not. Ah, uh, come on. Did you get your hands clammy too? Screw you. The bald spot's looking pretty but bright there, are dude. You sure you didn't leave any anyway. Militech won't notice a thing. Are you trying to insult me, Bobby? Okay, okay. Forget I even asked. Saul has lost control, apparently, of the avocados. Let's go. What the fuck? Nobody's gonna notice you gone back at camp? Saul has no wish to see us there anyway. The better to make a good second impression on the Biotechnica suits. Your sour faces wouldn't help much. Yeah. Indeed, they would not. Biotech's a good thing, but... And the Raffins, what about them? Expecting any trouble? Saul is. He's posted sentries all around the camp. How is that, that car not is right? sick. He's wrong in continuing to fight the symptoms rather than the disease. A little root cause analysis? Don't miss life in Night City. At times, perhaps. I miss the feeling of having a new beginning, of freedom, but I also haven't forgotten the emptiness. The feeling of realizing it means nothing if you're alone. Yeah, took adjustment on my part too, though never was completely alone. You had someone? A true friend, Jackie by name. You would have liked him actually. Jackie? Yeah. I'll remember that. These guys are not good at driving. We have arrived. Far out. The 101. Always construction on the 101. Every time I've been there. Big bastard. If you like it so much, maybe we should just hijack the train. Let the basilisk go on its way. Yeah. What do you mean? Then just drive this beast to the 101. Bear him back. Saul would be on board with that. Are we ready? Hold on. River? B. Hey. Okay. The Militech convoy will be traveling from Night City to the base where they're due to meet the buyer. We will Hold stop on. it at the Hold railroad on. crossing. All we have to do is shove this beauty in its way. V, any questions? Uh, I do, but I'm on the phone, so just ch chill for a second. Sounds like it. Okay. Let's happened? get to work. I should talk about this on the hollow. We gotta meet. When and where? Tell me. Glenn, tonight. I'll flick you the details. Go, okay. Make it. Do my best. I'm in the shit right Thanks, now, but. Till then. <sighs> All right.
Need a hand? Of course. But in your shoes, I would look for another way in first. I'm rude. Can I get up there. What's up, guys? All you had to do is say you needed me to get inside here. I've no big deal. I've always been fond of trains. And the stations where so many tracks converge. Hmm. Junctions. Yes, those. When you see them from above, you feel free. Like you could set off on a thousand journeys all at once. Perhaps more simply. Sure about. thing. Find a punch card. Okay. Not a. I found it. It's all good. Got something. What the fuck are you good looking job. at? Carol! We have a card! What now? You have to put it in the reader! <laughs> well, V? The card. In the reader? Calm down. <sighs> Here goes nothing. What's up, Johnny? Okay. Well. V, I wanted to speak with you. About what? What do you want to talk about? I know this may sound foolish, because I asked you to help me. But... Why are you doing this? I mean, I like you, Pan Am. You're cool. Because it's important to you. But is that all? I... Sorry. That sounded worse than I intended. Any more questions? No. I know everything I need to, I believe. Perhaps I should send Rogue flowers to thank her for introducing us. Hmm. Not really your style, don't think. I would add a card. Thank you for giving me a true friend, you manipulative whore. That's my girl. All right, let's rejoin the others. I know you're not into me, Pan Am, but I still like you. You're cool. I don't do everything for a price. Convoy, got eyes and ears on it? Yes, Carol checks their communication channels from time to time. Everything is proceeding as planned. For now. Do you know where Pan Am is? I'm not her babysitter, dude. Okay. I'll let her know, I guess. If I can. Hey, Pan Am. Saul is, uh, worried about you. Wants to know where you're at. What we're doing. If you're okay. 
No. Okay. We could still Sit your ass down a minute, honey. Breathe. Everything's under control. You set the up camp here. Already heading our way. You worried about Saul? Spooked. As if you're the first person ever to stand up to Saul. Ah, save your breath. I don't need to be consoled. Ah, was it someone I know? New. Scorpion. He came home from the war, head full of new ideas and a host of new contacts. He tried to get Saul to lead us in joining Snake Nation. It would make us stronger, he said. I don't think he peeped a word of it to me. What did Saul do? Saul dressed the guy down head to toe for messing with the family. Hell, he didn't send him on any jobs for a year. Gee, really consoling. Thanks. You said yourself you didn't need any. Ah, well, let's drink to Scorpion. How to raise yeah. a glass to Scorpion. To Scorpion. Jackie. Oh shit, to Jackie. Yeah. Gonna try and get some sleep. Okay, it'll be quite some time before the convoy comes through. Couldn't sleep if you tried, could you? I'll just lie here a while, by your side, gazing at the stars. That another area of your expertise? Got maps of the heavens in your library, too? Of course. That's the Big Dipper. And you see the small flickering star to the right? Yeah. You do? Oh, dear. That means there's a major leak. I don't even see the Big Dipper, dude. Good night, B. Good night, Pan Am. Okay, here they come. Is everyone ready? Uh, you could have not like Let's wake ride, wake me B. up earlier. Fuck. Let's fucking go. Okay. All right. She's moving. Get her up to speed. Disconnecting our car will make it faster, but do what we want, I guess. Surround them as soon as they're cut off. Get them, get them. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, shit. Hello.
Whoa, where are you going, Pan Am? Shit! Oh, a shotgun. No big deal. No big deal. Oops. We were not paying attention to our health, apparently. And our biomon was out. Interesting. Okay, here they come. Is everyone let's ready? See. Ammo. Yep, let's, let's go. Ride, v. Mitch, Bob, go. No big deal. Boss. No big deal. All right, the train's leaving. You better move. All right, let's go. Okay, let's go. Ready to roll. Ours now. <laughs> yes. We're all friends here. You don't need to land the horn like that. Fuck, What's up, Mitch? It worked. Of course it did. Just as I said it would. I feel like there's more to this. How's it going there, V? Did you have fun? Sure did. Yeah, I got to kill a bunch of people. It was great. Around to put the hunk of junk together. The real fun is just starting with Mitch and Teddy. Oh my. How was that? Oh. Okay, just lost the Militech channel. The suits finally realized someone was listening and changed the codes. <laughs> Perfect timing, if you ask me. We made it back to camp. It's ours now. I can talk to him if you want. No, thank you. I'll take care of this myself. Hey, Saul. Huh, I'll stand with these guys. So it begins. Meaning of this? Exactly what you see. The basilisk. All I see is two trucks with giant Militech logos on them. Fuck, Pan Am, you can see them from miles away. E you think we true. don't have problems enough on our hands? The Raffins could rear their heads at any moment. And now we have Militech to worry about, too. Stop it! And a basilisk. Fuck! Just shut up already! Do you oh. want to serve corporations forever? Calm down. Fine! Go right ahead! In that case, we'll leave the basilisk as a souvenir of what this family used to be. Or you know what? Maybe next time we're attacked, we'll be able to fight back. As soon she as did I bring you a basilisk. Bed, we call a family meeting to discuss this. Discuss you. Until that time, I want these trucks out of my sight. No. And the basilisk? Can we put it together? Do what you want. Just get out of my sight. Do what you want. Okay. Bob, Mitch, you two take the trucks around back. We need to unload. Sure, but then what do we do with them? Oh, I've got an idea. Yeah. Got quite a pair of lungs there. Thanks. I believe the last time I pulled something like that, I was 10 years old. 
Seems still to be in fine working order. Everything okay? Yes, of course. <laughs> Though the great train robbery bit of this was much more enjoyable. You need me again. All you gotta do is call. V. I'm sure I will. So you'd better expect that call. Be waiting. Take care. I also will not say no to credits, please. I know we're friends and all, and I didn't ask for any, but still, I'm very poor. <sighs> all right. Oh, the time.